Welcome back to Airport Madness 3D. I'm Tenacious Viking, your air traffic controller host. And we're going to um, try something. Uh, we're going to try to recreate uh, a situation that uh, another player identified to the developer. But it's uh, uh, traffic rate 8 at Toronto, but using uh, 6, 8, and 15. And <clears throat> I, I, it's been a while since I've used these runways. So I may have to do this twice, once in this episode and once in the next episode. I'm just going to play 20 minutes at traffic rate 8 because uh, this particular player said that this gets all jammed up, uh, that it can't handle all the traffic. So <clears throat> we're going to do that. Um, <clears throat> Personally, I think expedite is in order because they end up in the same place, remember? <laughs> Which is a little dangerous. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to change this to uh, 8. I have no idea the timing on these. I'm going to do an uh, uh, immediate takeoff and see if I get away with it. I'd like to do uh, departures on 15 because it's right here. Uh, otherwise, I have to go around to 8. <clears throat> and then I can't use uh, 15 for anything, which I think is going to be a problem. I do not want arrivals on 15. <clears throat> but see, I can do that. Now, let me do a, uh, a normal departure right on the numbers there. But that's a... That's a uh, Concord, and that's going to be pretty fast. So I'm going to do an expedite. <coughs> this is the danger area here. And I don't know if these guys stay out of each other's way or not. Nope, they don't. See, that's... You know, I don't know what to do about that, you know. Uh, you got a small plane, and uh, unless you, you're gonna have to watch everything. Come on, move it. That is not even in the picture yet, is it? Okay. So I'm only gonna be able to do arrivals on on either eight or six. Can't do both. It just doesn't work. I could do arrivals on six and do uh, the two uh, the uh, small plane uh, departures on eight. Um, I, I just I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna try this and see what happens. I think I did this, uh, I think this is the one I did the Skycam. And it actually worked because I could see what was coming and, and kind of judge that a little bit. But, uh... Why would a plane come all the way around there? That's dumb. <clears throat> Bring this in a little faster and do a departure here. And and I have to do an expedite uh, of every plane, pretty much. Now, can the gates handle all this and keep planes moving? I have two Concords arriving on zero 06. Good lord. 
and uh, 747 on 160. I don't know if they're on a collision path or not. I'm going to find out, I guess. I'm just trying stuff here, okay? This is a Concord. He should be fast enough. Now, see this? Yeah, see, this is full now. This, can, this cannot handle it. Uh, I'll have to land planes on 15 and, and skip 6, or skip 8 maybe, and send departures. To eight, I I don't know. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep up with this and see if I can figure anything out. But I uh, I can see already this probably isn't gonna work. Can I do an immediate departure here? I think I can, because nothing's. Why do they come from that way? Uh, so dumb. So I should do anything that comes over here to six, and then those who, that come all the way around can do eight. Right? Sure. Future to seven, six, six. Speed up. Future to seven, six, six. Expedite off. Runway zero, six. Five, Look at that. Two, nine, seven. Roger. We have planes uh, backed up here already. Um, they just, they simply can't handle it. Why, um, boy, I barely got, uh, this is a nightmare already. I, I don't know, I don't, I don't see any way to do this. Sci-fi, you got a plan for this? <laughs> I'm trying to clear them from the gates as soon as they're ready, but uh, that isn't easy either. I don't know what's going on there. Oh, there's a 15. Okay, that's got to be an 8. It's got to be slowed down. This, come on. Look at this mass. <coughs> Wow. There is no way for all these planes to clear this spot right here. No way. Try to keep an eye on those uh, <coughs> pushbacks. I got to keep this cleared. Look at that. They can't. They can't get out of the way here. Because there's no place for them to go. No, that's. That's a nightmare. <clears throat> that is a nightmare. Starboard. Five, six, seven, slow down. Five, five, six, five, slow down. Night two, three, zero, expedite off. Runway zero eight. Starboard five, nine, three. Trying to get planes away from that gate as quickly as possible, but um, can't be done. You know? Two, one, two, speed up. Starboard. Five, six, seven, 
7, expedite off. Runway, 0, 8. Whoa. I don't know what happened there. Alright. Issuing go rounds. I've got no room. Now, if you're playing uh, time trial, can't do it. You know? Just can't. How long is it taking him to get to, uh, there we go. Look at how long it's taking just to clear that line of planes there. They have no place to go. Yeah. You have to land. I think I think you have to land on 15. Gives planes. You have to do a cross there, but at least it gives the planes a place to park for a while. <coughs> I think uh, arrivals on 15, uh, on 1, 5, and, and departures on 0, 8. Maybe, maybe smaller planes on 0, 6. There. Now we're finally getting enough planes moved. There. But I had to do a bunch of go-rounds. Wow. I guess we'll just let that go. Okay, now I can bring some planes in. I got a little room. <coughs> don't dare bring in that concrete any faster because it's kind of crowded down there right now in fact it's very crowded those planes turn those corners really slowly there are no planes at the gate but those uh, planes are moving very very slowly that's uh, that's pretty alarming. I'm going to do two extended approaches here and get some of these planes moved. That helped a little bit. I only got two planes at the gates. Okay, that's good. That's good. Got some room for. I was going to do uh, these on six. Okay. We're moving planes now.
This is kind of a nightmare. Anybody have an idea on the best way to handle uh, 6, 8, and 15? Uh, just on a good day, <laughs> which this is not, but... We send this one to 8 and this one to 6. So we'll take different paths and hopefully not run into each other. But they might anyway. Uh, I think they'll be alright. Okay. Alright, that looks pretty good. I'm, I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment. That's a zero 08. Yep, it is. Well, we, one of these has got to come in first, so let's do it. Where did this guy come from? Wow. If I can keep that area uh, by the gates uh, clear, I've got a shot, you know? I hope this FA-27 can get ahead of the SW-4 and... Yeah, I think so. Eight and eight. Okay. Sure would like to be able to squeeze in a departure here sometime soon. I've got a chance, I guess. Oh, you're going to 15? Oh, that's no good. Let's uh, change you to six. I thought you were going to six. Hit those numbers. <clears throat> Eight, two, three, zero. Clear for takeoff. Runway one five. Five three one two. Clear for takeoff. Runway one five. Buzz nine two five. Roger. Buzz nine two five. Roger. Nine two one two. Probably shouldn't have sent that one, but I'm going to anyway just to see if I. Get away with it or not. See, this is getting backed up back here again now. No place to put those. Can't see that bottom uh, plane turn red there. Keep it turned kind of this way. If I do, yeah, see, if I do departures on 08, I can't really do 
arrivals on 15, can I? Hmm. I mean, I can, but it's going to be involved crosses. Future to seven, six, six. Request taxi. Night two, three, zero. Will land runway zero eight. Future to two, two, seven. Request taxi. On the one hand, they're they're poking me in here, and that messes up my departures. On the other hand, I'm kind of glad they are. Everybody wants 15 all of a sudden. What is the deal? All right, <laughs> let's get some planes two, four, three, off the ground. And arrivals. Do some go arounds. I'm going to fill hit each other. Those two are not my job. Just these two more, two more departures and I'm good. All right, let's uh, take see if we can get this departure without crashing. <laughs> That's going to do it for me for this episode. Good try. I'm going to try this again in the next episode and do that a little differently, uh, see if it makes any difference. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe, if you would, please, uh, by clicking on the TV TV circle and uh, check out some of the other games I play as well. Thank you so much for watching, for commenting, for subscribing, for liking, and just generally for being part of the Tenacious Viking community. Join me next time when Tenacious Viking plays Airport Madness 3D.